COVID happened. Um, and I ended up going to take the exam anyways, of course. Uh, I think it was like $35. <laughs> we had to go write it in one of the like hotels here. Um, again, it was like the the older men in this room, and they, you know they were they were just getting off their like construction job, and I just walked in, and it was very interesting. Um, so I went, and you just need to have your 4C or 4U English in high school, or your equivalent OSSD in Ontario, or your high school diploma and you would go online and you would sign up for a slot of when you can write the test um, and they send you a booklet and you would just have to review the booklet. There's tons of videos online for the technical side of it. The OIT is pretty much just the technical side of it. There's no hands-on anything. It was relatively easy for me integrate to integrate into doing the OIT from college just because that's all of what I've been learning and because I've had a class on it it was easy for me um, the test was you have to get a 70% or higher and I there's four classes that you have to write so there's class one to four and you can write all four at once or you can only write one or you can go one and two it's really up to the person depending on how much they want to do. So there's like distribution, there's sewage, etc. Um, I wrote all four at once and I found that um, it was it's 100 questions. It's 25 questions per, per class and it was, yeah, it was fine. You know, I didn't, I'm not too good at, you know, math and all of that. I find that I have the passion there. So that's what helped me. Um, but you do have to have a strong love for math, a strong love for, for chemistry and conceptual planning.